In this time of absolute darkness, we must unite to bring forth the light of hope. The time has come. Yes, this is the dawn of a new age. And so the Militus Empire, home to the White Peristilium, invaded the neighboring dominion of Rubrum. As soon as the declaration of war was made, the Militesi main fleet swarmed into all corners of Rubrum. At the same time, a separate fleet was charged with a sneak attack on the Vermilion Peristilium. A lassie accompanied this task force. Using a lassie to invade a sovereign state was a direct violation of the Pax Codex, a treaty created by all four crystal states of Orients. The besieged Palestilium attempted to repel Militess' Magitek armors with powerful magic. Not even the mighty warships could withstand the awesome power of the summoned Eidolans. It seemed that the Militesi offensive would fail. However, the Lassi Kunmi led a special unit past Wubrun's defenses and activated a new weapon, the Crystal Jammer, neutralizing the power of the Vermilion Bird Crystal. Severed from the source of their magical powers, the Rubrum forces were quickly overwhelmed and overrun. Imperial Marshal Sid Olstein demanded of Chancellor Kalian Cheval VI, the leader of Rubrum, that he surrender and transfer the Vermilion Bird Crystal to Militesi control. Your crystal cannot protect you. Resistance is no longer an option. You have six hours. You must comply with our demands, or face the full might of our forces. In which case, I promise you, the roads of Rubrum will run red with the blood of her people. May the crystal 